My name is Alex Voss, and I am a rum distiller here in Punta Gorda, Florida. I learned to make rum on the island of Maui in Hawaii back in 2012, and I gained an apprenticeship that I found on Craigslist. Uh, now I worked for the Maui Rum Company for a little over two years and was encouraged by my family and friends to come home back to Florida to make my own rum. Alligator Bay Distillers is a micro craft rum distillery. Our business is family operated. We have my mom who is the president uh, of the company and then my brother and myself. Now I'm the distiller and my brother is the apprentice and he's also our brand ambassador. Every day we come in and we're just making rum. We work six days a week. Uh, typically we're here uh, 10 hours a day, if not a little longer, uh, always providing tours and tastings. We source our raw material in Clues in Florida. We're using just Floridian molasses to make our rum. We have to dilute it. Molasses now is very thick, it's tar-like. And you have to make it soluble so that when you bring it into fermentation, the yeast can consume the sugars in those molasses, creating alcohol. Once fermentation is complete, we then bring it through our distillation system, knock the alcohol content down a little bit before we dump it into an American oak barrel. When you start out, there's no manual that says, this is what you need to do and this is how it should be done. You make your mistakes, uh, hopefully you don't make the same one twice, and you just kind of take the punches and keep rolling. Going through the College of Business at FGCU gave me the tools I needed to know about accounting, know about business strategy, creating a business plan. These are the steps that you need to take when you start from scratch. Businesses don't just come out of thin air. Uh, you have to know your service or your product and your market. My experience at FGCU was great. It was very beneficial to me because I had to stay local. Now at the end of my junior year, my father had passed away. My mom had asked if I would consider staying close to home and going to school nearby. And of course, Gulf Coast University was right there. And I could commute back and forth. I could still get the education that I was desiring to have and just show support and have that support too. Growing up as a child, the last thing I wanted to do was stay in Florida. As soon as I graduated high school, I wanted to get as far away as I could. Now, of course, it didn't happen, and I became even more local, if you may, uh, staying close to home. Now I appreciate that I did that, because turning around and looking at my local community, fabulous people, tons to do, uh, it's beautiful, and uh, I'm glad that ultimately my life path brought me to FGCU and to uh, what I'm doing today.